I always wake up and check the weather to see what's best for the day. If it's cold and dry, I'm gonna go ice climbing. I gotta call Drew. The ice conditions are looking so good. It looks like the ice in Maple is gonna be really good. I will pack my bags and I will see you soon. Pretty simple gear, rope, ice screws, tools, crampons, boots, whiskey. Got this new unbreakable adventure pack canteen from Tin Cup. Let's see if it's really unbreakable. <laughs> this canteen is incredible. I think it could pretty much handle anything. We're gonna go to Maple because it is kind of a once in a lifetime season there. Utah had a lot of snow and it started to warm up, but it's still freezing at night. So what you get with that is big fat ice. This whole canyon that we're in is in condition. So here we are. And there's an anchor up to the left. Up and left. Yep. Fun, man. That's kind of cool. I don't know. Frozen waterfalls, man. Maybe just watch me good. Yeah. Because getting to the first boat might be full value. Matt doesn't get nervous. Nervous gets nervous from Matt. Being from Miami, Florida, I don't know that I was really made for this, but you know. You do it. I do it. I force myself into it. You do it for the mountains. Locked and loaded. Oh, 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 oh. We'll climb this bottomless and topless. A little bit of mixed climbing, a little bit of ice climbing, which is always exciting. Take it off. Summits feel so good. getting cold, which means that it's time for hot toddy. Tin cup thrown. You don't always know what you're gonna do, but that's totally part of the adventure. Cheers. Cheers Good day. If it's cold, cool. Ice climbing. If it's warm and sunny, sweet. Rock climbing. Mo, ah! oh, how are you? Len is stoked to meet up this weekend in Panatente. What do you think? Southern Colorado weather is looking sweet. It's like to go do some sport climbing, some grilling, climbing with my friend Mo do some cooking with my friend Len. Sport climbing season. Penitente, Southern Colorado, it's like a really cool place to road trip to. Mo, this weather, I think today's gonna be a great day for sport climbing. It feels sandy. My two friends, Len Nessifer and Mo Beck, are gonna be joining, which I'm really excited about. Nice job, Bo. We're getting through our warm up. Now we're gonna head over to the main zone, which is where that beautiful Madonna painting is. For the <laughs> I'm just turning these old tortillas into tortilla chips. Whoa. Yeah, it's beat up. Well, you know, it's already gone on some adventures with me already. Could you imagine if this thing was glass? It would have broken on the first day. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah. Thanks for coming out, guys. Wow. So good. The winds died down in the dunes, and Len is really trying to keep the ski season alive. No snow, no problem. No weather is going to break his spirit. Yeah. I just peeked at the weather this week in Boulder and it looks splitter. 
We're gonna have some people over to grill and then maybe do a lap on the second flat iron. Making some whiskey gingers. That's what's happening. What do you guys think? A little quick romp. One of the sweetest parts about living in Boulder is having flat irons in your backyard. Let's go. Every bottle's got a story to tell. This unbreakable canteen has been through a lot. This thing can handle any adventure. 